Hi, this is Jennifer of Little Red Stockings. I recently wrote an article on my website which is about my tips and suggestions for making baby clothes that are simply amazing. So one of the things I love about making baby clothes is I feel that they're perfect for beginners. With baby clothes you don't have to worry about getting gauge as much as you would worry about it with making an adult sweater. And one of the reasons is that if you make a baby sweater or a baby soaker a little bit bigger than it should be, your baby is going to grow into it. So there's that lessened pressure about getting gauge, which is one of the hardest things to deal with in knitting. Another thing I love to tell people is that baby knitting should not be expensive. There are really great patterns for babies and toddlers which are free on Ravelry. Baby clothes don't have to be the standard pastel colors, nor do they have to be acrylic. I love making baby clothes in wool, and I know that there's a big controversy about whether baby clothes should be made out of wool or not because some babies are allergic to wool. However, I just read an article that said that some babies are allergic to some of the more plastic yarns. And also, I think we have to keep in mind what Elizabeth Zimmerman says, which is babies have been wearing wool for years. I've even heard that some people make baby blankets out of acrylic and they melt them slightly so that they never have to be blocked and you can just throw them in the wash and you don't have to worry about them shrinking. So when it comes to colors for baby clothes, I don't always like to stick to the standard light pastels. In fact, I typically don't make my baby clothes light pastels. I love to use darker, rich, deep tones. And I can show you one of my favorite baby sweaters. This pattern's from a book called The Expectant Knitter. And I love this gorgeous orange. This is actually from Good Karma Farms. And their yarn not only is so incredibly soft and just perfect for a baby, but I absolutely love their colorways. Here's another example of a baby sweater, which I think just came out so awesome. It has these gorgeous leaves, and I love that I use the deeper, darker color. I think it's just so beautiful. So my favorite unisex baby colors, probably my number one favorite is red. And after that, I really like green, orange, and yellow. And I've definitely become more appreciative of yellow over the years. I have another example of a little yellow sweater I made. And this pattern is called Peanut. And I actually bought it, the pattern at Sheep and Wool Festival um, by Green Mountain Spinnery. But I just love the yellow of this sweater. I think it's so beautiful. I think the best suggestion I can give you today is that if you make a baby sweater that's a little on the plain side, go out and buy some really adorable buttons for it. It will make it extra cute and adorable.